All right, we are just coming back into civilization after almost well, a day and a half, almost two days of being in the middle of nowhere. Should not have taken that route. So we were gonna to try to get from Stanley to Hobart without backtracking, and that just doesn't happen. But we tried to make it happen, and we ended up in the middle of nowhere. Last night we slept in the middle of nowhere, like in this gravel pit, like a thousand meters above sea level in the, in the clouds. The high country of Tasmania is not for a camper van. So for anyone wanting to go from Stanley to Carina, from Carina to Waratah, it's fucked. Don't do it. Unless you're in like a hectic full drive camper van. Anyway, so we're going to the National Park. So we might need to get a National Park pass once we get there. We don't really know what we're doing. We're a bit backyard here in Tasmania. So today we're probably going to do the Dove Lake walk around Cradle Mountain. So we're just filling up here at this 24 hour fuel bowser. And apparently Cradle Mountain you have to catch a shuttle bus. So look at this car park. Show them the car park babe. You can't really see but behind the van is like full. And we're like what the fuck's everyone doing here? Turns out you have to catch a shuttle bus. So everyone parks here and then gets on a bus. And we're not booked in or anything. So we're proper backyarders. Ooh. Breezy. So it's $58 for the day. And that includes buses to and from Dove Lake. And 15 minute stopovers everywhere we go. So we've got till 5.30. 5.30 is the last bus. Alicia's making a whole bunch of sandwiches, chucking the backpack. Apparently it's like a three or four hour turnaround by the time you catch the bus, do Dove Lake Circuit. Mm -hmm. Then we're gonna go find some wombats. Got the backpack on and everything. Cut the sandwiches, the water. This is the bag I used to take to work every day. So I'm getting a bit of depression. Have a look at this tree, it's 1700 years old. Look at all the rings on it they've counted. Could be even more actually. 1900. This room we're in, wouldn't mind camping in here, that's for sure. Mm, 3D. Oh. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> All right, let's start this walk. It's like coming out into a movie scene. Here, and I ended up making it in the newspaper of Tasmania. I was like 12 years old. Just from one extreme to the other.
We've been walking for about an hour. We're legit right at the bottom of Cradle Mountain. So it makes about two hours, two and a half hours return by the time you take your photos and have a sandwich. I want to go up there and touch the snow. Now we're in a rainforest and there's a waterfall just up there on the other side of the lake. It's crazy. Besides hell, Steve, <laughs> we're gassed. Look at that though, look at the snow on there. We've had a strip off. Somehow the drink bottle spilt through the bag. And we're sweating balls. It's, it's raining like real light mist. It's actually really nice. Every time I stop, my legs are like jittering, shaking, <laughs> but you don't feel it until you stand still. It's not even a hard track though. Nah. We're just getting back into the rhythm after being obese with my parents on the Great Ocean Road. That's all. But we're all done. None of this was here when I come here as a kid. You used to come down here just with your car, with the National Parks Pass. Now they've got like proper buildings and architecture. And the only thing that gets you down here is a uh, shuttle bus. So it was $58 for the park pass and shuttle bus. Look at all the wombats. This whole hill is full of wombats. Look at the size of that thing up there. This is called Ron. Uh, what's it called? It's an overland track. Overland track. Ronnie. Ronnie's what? Ronnie's Creek. And the whole thing's full of wombats. We've already spotted like ten. Look at them all on the hill. Look at all their holes. Believe it or not, there's actually a, f a free camp just there. And then over the fence is grass. They want you to pay there. And then there's another camp behind the pub right here. It's $10 per person per night. And that's showers and toilets and everything. So, 
We're about to go in and see what the go is. We just parked up here at the pub. Alicia's having a shower, 10 bucks per person for the night. And that's a shower as well. Now I'm just gonna sit here, edit the video, watch the sun go down. Little creek in the background there. That's all. Oh, what do we have here, babe? What have you cooked up? It's all creamy broccoli, garlic with potato. Delicious. Good night.